real quick. I appreciate the interview. Yeah. I'm gonna pass it. Ain't no cops around here. Okay. Bringing you this footage. Bringing you this footage of a 1968 RS Camaro. Not RSSS, RS. Rally Sport. Rally Sport. Rally Sport. True Rally Sport. With the hideaway headlights. Y'all saw the lights open and close. Y'all saw them open and close. Y'all saw them open and close. Yeah. Uh oh, he gonna get down on it. He gonna get down on it. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. That's why I'm talking about. That's why you watch this channel. That's exactly why. Yeah. How you doing, sir? I'm doing fine. All right. Tell me what we have here. This is a 1969 Chevrolet Camaro. Okay. Um, that I have owned since I was 17 years old. Wow. Um, I bought it for a whopping $600. Okay. And uh, when I did, um, it was a neighbor friend of mine that uh, wanted to trade her car in. And that's all they were going to give her. Okay. I jokingly told her, I said, I'd be glad to give you 600 bucks. She said, from you, I'd take it. Okay. So <laughs> I ended up buying it. About broke my neck to get inside the house to, to get the, uh, the money for it. And uh -huh. I ended up buying it, and I've never regretted it since. Okay. Um, in the past five years, I've attempted to restore it. Okay. And um, I've, I've gone through the thing quite well um, over the years. I can tell. It um, it actually has a 350 engine in it. Okay. Um, and a 350 turbo hydromatic automatic transmission. Okay. It has a regular rear end in it. It's not um, a, a, a positive traction. Okay. But um, I've uh, owned this car, like I said, for umpteen years, and it's a situation where I've, this is the third engine, second transmission, second rear end. Um, but uh, I've, I've made some modifications to this one that uh, I've never done before. Right. Um, this actually has, as you can tell, a lot of chrome on it. Okay. Um, this has um, has air conditioning. Okay. Um, That's a vintage air unit? That is a vintage air unit, yes, sir. Okay. Uh, they make one from the 69 Camaro. Okay. Um, I've actually got um, all the way around, um, all disc brakes, all the way okay. around. Okay. Okay. It has... Um, Brand new exhaust system. Uh, the exhaust system is a pipes exhaust system. Okay. Uh, these are um, Headman headers. Okay. That are on it. Okay. Uh, as you can tell, the firewall has been shaved. And okay. It's nothing like any other um, any other firewall that you normally see. It's uh, pretty. Just, just cleaned it up. Uh huh. Um, interior of the the actual Camaros were a flat black. And right. I decided that I wanted to paint a matching um, paint that would that would go through without the whole car. Okay. So that's what I chose to do. Um, it is uh, painted uh, white and blue, as you can tell. Mm -hmm. um, it's the paint job is about three years old. Okay. Um, it has uh, just recently gone through the interior um, redone. Uh, the interior was redone, just finished up about two weeks ago. Who did the interior? Um, a gentleman in um, Cary, North Carolina. Um, his name is Benito, and he did, uh, he's with uh, Triangle Interiors. Okay. Absolutely fabulous company to work with. Uh, they did an absolutely wonderful job on the interior. It's all okay. leather, okay. white leather to match the white stripes. Okay. And that's something that you don't normally see. It also has the old-fashioned houndstooth interior of years gone by. The 67 through 69 did that for a while on the Z28s, the Rally Sports, the Super Sports. Uh, they did those, um, but this was done by Benito, and when he did it, um, I wanted it a little bit different than most. Mm -hmm. So it's all leather interior, okay. um, houndstooth interior with a blue and white type of uh, pattern. Um, it's got dual exhaust, um, stainless steel gas lines, stainless steel brake lines, uh, stainless steel gas tank, um, all uh, stainless steel exhaust, 
all the way through, front to back. Um, but um, this is something I've been wanting to do with this car since I was a teenager. Well, look, you have you've done a wonderful job, and um, the thing about owning a car for this long, you can make progression over the years. Yes, you can. Okay. Yes, you can. It, All it right. takes that. It okay. It really does. Um, as they say, Rome wasn't built in a day. Right. And it takes time to do what you want to do with one, and this is a, about a five-year process. Okay. From the time, this was a rust bucket. Believe it or not. Okay. It had yeah. Rust all over the whole car. So let me ask you this: This yes, was an original Z28 car. It is not. Okay. It is fine. A fine. Fine. But it looks good. Well, thank you. You don't even yeah, have to explain. You don't even have to explain. I, it looks good. One. Right. And so that's because I was wondering if that lady you bought it from, you no. know, if you you know if she no. bought if she was riding around in the Z28, no, I was going to say that was the only reason I asked that question. No, she did not. Okay. Um, I wanted to clone it. Okay. It looks good. It looks good. And tell me about the engine, please. What, what had you done to the engine? Well, or, is, is this uh, the engine that was in it when you got it? Actually, no. Okay. Um, this is the third engine, as I mentioned earlier. Okay. I actually had a 307 uh, cubic inch engine in it. This mm -hmm. is a plain Jane car, as I call them. Uh, 307 cubic inch. I went to a 327, and now I'm up to a 350. Okay. Um, I made a few modifications, as you can tell here. Um, I chromed out the engine quite a bit. Um, put a little uh, extra money into that. It's got an Edelbrock carburetor on it, um, Edelbrock intake, um, vintage air, air conditioning. Um, this is a, uh, a March um, suspension. March, March pulley system? March pulley system, exactly. Okay. Um, but it, um, overall, it's, it's been a, a, a great car all the years that I've owned it. Uh, Needs a little polishing, but other mm -hmm. than that, it, uh, it, uh, it, it runs well, it, it does a good job. What kind of radiator is this? This is a, um, I want to say it's a... Be cool. No. Griffin. No, sir. It was a, I can't think of the name of it now. Okay. It stumped me. Don't worry about it. No it's, it's not important. I mean, it does good. It does a good job. Yeah, and it is it, aluminum radiator. Okay. And it's, a, um, it's the, the same type as a four core. Uh, aluminum radiator, but it's okay. a two core. And then now they're making them to where um, they will handle up to 650 horsepower. Wow. In a two core. Mm. Um, so that's that's what I chose to do and um, had no problems with the cooling system. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, you've done an impeccable job on it. Well, thank you. An impeccable job. So this was love at first sight for you? Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Um, this car, um, I, I noticed it with my, with my next door neighbor owning it. And she, uh, she had it for years. And I told her if she ever wanted to sell it, let me know. Mm -hmm. And she did. How old were you when you told her that? If you bought it at 17. I, I, I was telling her that at 16. Okay. And I got it from her with 80,000 miles on it at 17. Wow. Yeah. Hmm. So... Um, it's uh, gone through quite the transformation. It certainly has. Okay. All right. But it, it isn't like overdone where it looks ridiculous and it still looks like a real car. Well, thank you. I appreciate yeah. that. We've, uh, we've, we've done some interior modifications, as you can tell. Okay. Um, the dash, the console, um, the headliner, the, the seats mm. themselves. The, wait a minute. The headliner is leather. Yes. Mm. All new carpet. Uh, it has the um, the cooling insulation material. You mind if I squeeze this low? No. <laughs> I just wanted to touch it so bad. Now I'm good now. I'm it's, good now. <laughs> one thing that you notice uh, in, in other um, actual Camaros, years ago they had uh, flat bench seats. Yeah. Well, when I took it to the gentleman that, that was redoing the interior, uh -huh. I had him make this into a bucket back seat okay you will notice that that is totally different it sure is it sure is i've never seen that anything like that not in a camaro so it, it's it's a little bit different this is something that i wanted to do for years mm -hmm. and um they did a pretty good job with it man this is fantastic hey, fantastic thank you, thank you. fantastic and what's no uh, went into the trunk with it okay yeah oh man no junk in the trunk <laughs> 
None at all. Oh man. I've never had a trunk this clean. I'm just gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna put it out there for, I'm gonna put it out there for everybody. Wow. I really like this. I really like this. And this is man, they did a bang up job. This inter these interior people. These interior people just I just To me, 69 Camaro and Z28 go together like peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> I mean, when you see a 69 Z28, it's just, it really doesn't get much better than that. A lot of fun. A lot of fun. And I'm always elated to see someone who's owned one for a long time. A look, since, I mean, I'm talking about since youth. Um, you know, since youth, yep. which you probably still young now, but oh um. no no no, I'm, I'm a 62 year old man. <laughs> oh man, this is awesome. This is awesome. Hey, could you crank it up and let me get some sound? Sure. Do you mind? You want me? Do you mind if I close this door? Sure. Please. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, I like that. I like that. No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, see that, see that, yeah, she idles good, yeah, she idles good, yeah, she idles good, oh man, she runs so smooth, oh, you got digital gauges, she didn't tell me about the digital gauges, Digital. Okay. Dash. Oh man. Um, they're, they're gray white backlit. Um, the color of the car. Okay. Okay. You can close it up. You can close it up. Yeah. All right. I always did like them park lights. And the Z28. Oh man, she look good, boy. She look good. Y'all drop in the comments and tell me what you think about this. 69 Z28. And I like the cow hood. It just flows so smooth. That, that was one of the, the premium things about the Z28. Is, um, is they always had the, the spoiler on the back, the, the raised cow hood. Those, those were interesting pieces that, that I bought, additional things. But, uh, they're neat cars. All right. All right. 69 Camaro, baby. Who likes 69 Z28? 69 Z28. 69. 69 Z28. 69 Z28, y'all. 69 Z28. Yes!